Let's try this now. I don't need stab anyways. Stab is overrated. And I'm somehow losing this fight for reasons. Hello, chat. Hello, hello. Ah. Let's take a look at chat here. Apologies, I had to grab a snack. Space Viking, the first one. What's up, Teddy? Devian, never click so fast. Cheers, man. FG, Airy, corrects, cotton candy. There we go. What's up, Philips Galaxy? Stream time. The greenest green. Welcome, Alan. Hello. What achiever are we doing this time? It's called Cotton Candy and then the Buddhist Strike Back. I'll explain it all in a moment. But a welcome one. Last time I was this early, the Kalmar Union was still a thing. <laughs> Gray Wolves, what's up? Good morning. Can't wait for some free candy. Dreams of Alexandria, I agree. Uga. Hello, hello, hello. Silver. Giannis. Corrects. Yo. How you doing, Aerie? No one conquers the Tamil Kings? You'll see. There he is. Hello, Andreas. How are you, buddy? What's up? Still catching up on chat here. Having some subcontinent fun? Oh, yes. What's up, Aberko? Free almonds. Hmm. If I liked almonds, I would be excited about that. But hello, regardless. <laughs> What's up, some Dutch boy? Drakrath? How did the Tengri Poland horde? Tengri Poland? Um... Bumpy, to say the least. We ended up saves coming a ton, and then I ended up just calling it because we got attacked by Hungary with, like, a huge coalition. Not a coalition, but, like, a huge ally network. It was annoying. New Prussia episode, yeah. Another one coming up here in about uh, two hours, so stay tuned for that. Oh, flips. My bad. <laughs> right, my bad. Flips Galaxy. What's up, Hyperclaw? How you doing, buddy? Ever want to explore other government types? Um... I mean, I have, yeah. On what? What's on the menu today? We're gonna do cotton candy, into uh, the Buddha Strike Back, and I'll, I'll show you guys here in a moment. Very important question: Be renaming the province of Vanny to Van and Candy to Candy. Van Candy. Ooh, I see what you did there. Hey, what's up, MP Newt? Tease log. How are you, buddy? So, load into this game, huh? Let's go with candy. Hey, thanks for the follow, boys. A Gale and Peroxide Penguin, glad to have you guys here. How is it going, everybody? I agree. That joke went over my head. <laughs> van candy? Yeah, it took a second. Ooh, ooh, van candy. Uh, I'm just gonna go without that. I never even read that. The No Name Mate. Welcome, buddy. All right. So, let's take a look at our ideas here. Trade and fort defense. Apparently, we have a vassal who is, like, st way stronger than me. Makes sense? So, that's actually not bad. But he's... At Ooh, okay. So, I am a vassal... Oh, I'm a vassal of Kote. Okay, that makes more sense. <laughs> Seven Dev Capital, you like that? India is legit a Thunderdome. Trust no one. I agree. Hello there, Huddy Streams. How you doing? Going for cotton candy? Yes, we are. Thought we were in Southeast Asia. Any plans to play that before the update? Uh no. It doesn't why would it why would I do that? <laughs> play in the area that's getting an update before it gets the update. Area that's pretty boring and Monsoons just make it so it takes you an hour and a half to march between each province. Feeling this is going to be an OP very quickly. We'll see. Let's uh, get this on here. Hi, chat. How you guys all doing today? <clears throat> Free for all. It is true. Thunderdome, no doubt. Even his rival won't so support my independence. Garbage. 
All right. There's literally no reason to not click that, so let's do it. What happened to the Coptic Faith series? It was just not doing well, so Quag and I decided to call it. Sadly, this is a really sick flag, though. It's literally a lion holding a sword. The visor costs 20%. That's pretty good. It means we'll be able to hire a mill advisor early on. Let's go with mill. Um. Hmm. Did I set the video to go live as well? Yes, I did. Okay, cool. Name though. Five times as fast as you can. Yeah. Sena. Sena Samatha. Wikarambahathu. Siri Sengabo. <laughs> yeah, that's crazy, actually. I think it's similar to modern Sri Lanka's flag. Is it? I was thinking Sri Lanka's flag was a uh, tricolor or something, but I'm not sure. Anyways, how do we do this? First off, let's see if there's a single person who wants to support us, support our independence. Not a one. Lion is still on the Sri Lankan flag? Oh, okay, cool. The lion symbol. Get the four realms grouped together again for 1.31. I agree. I'm down. I definitely agree. I think that the thing with you and me, Quag, was that there wasn't any, like, impending doom or anything like that. And that you were just, you were doing your thing, I was doing my thing, and there wasn't nearly as much banter. I think that that was kind of one of the things that hurt us, sadly. We're just not funny when it's just the two of us. <laughs> All right, so how do we do this? I, I actually don't know. Build up the force limit, of course. Let's have our ships protect trade. Confederate flag. Is there a Confederate flag somewhere? OMG! You bigot! Wish you luck. Tried fighting in India? Japanese Celestial Empire. Ooh, yikes. Living hell. Yeah, the monsoons are cancer. I hate the monsoons a lot, actually. All right, so let's see here. What's up, Bernstein? Watching the Coptic Faith series before bed to wind down. I'm sorry. So let's see here. Prove relations with these guys. See if we can... Um... Okay, my... My... All right, I guess. Slogging toward world conquest gets slowly, slow pretty quickly. It's comparable to Germany, I think. Did the stream just start or did I 1444? Stream just started and we got this dude, apparently. And I got an heir. What are these crazy ass names? Yeah, what's up, Phantom? Oh, champ. What's up, Rosen? Yeah, I got a... I got a 453 for negative prestige and 20 legitimacy and no stab. Feels bad, man. All right, we'll see how it goes. Classic half-decent leader in their trash air. Yeah. Never surprises me, huh? Gotta say, being dyslexic and... This area of the world must be a nightmare. Holy crap, I can imagine. Kote wants a royal marriage. It's a no from me, good sir. Let's get our stab boosted up. And we just need to keep an eye on um, who would support our independence. I think he's his rival, but he's not rivaled to our guy, Kote. Oh, he's allied to Balmanis. Okay. <laughs> Amonis doesn't have a navy. So honestly, if I get naval supremacy, we can win. But that's cancer. That's that's legit the dumbest thing ever. Yeah, it makes sense that this giant guy is going to ally a three-province miner. Okay. He's got six trade ships. Oh, no. He has, like, no ships, honestly. We'll get, like, a galley or two, and that should be good. Then we can just steamroll them. I think we can make it work. Right, so let's take a look at these. Oh, 
All right, monastic orders, apparently. So let's start off by doing that. Who wants to be upset? Admin points for prestige of at least 30. Well, I would like to do that, but we'll see. Or just dev up our province. That's fine, I'll do that. Jane loyalty is good. All right, so let's see here. And then... State maintenance and dev cost? Really? Just for clicking a button? Okay, sounds good. Nobility can have supremacy, right of council, increased levies, and mill points. Increased levies. National attack them off for another 8%. I will gladly take that. Sure. Mill advisor cost. For stab cost. We'll see. Not many other nations to ally. I know. It's a bummer. No, no. Are you talking? If you're talking about him, that's you are wrong for sure. There's he has plenty of allies, options. The fact that he chose this tells me that they're probably just targeting the player. But that's okay. We'll figure it out. I like I said. I think as long as we get naval supremacy, we're good. Because we can just blockade this straight. He's got six light ships. I have five ships total, so we can probably make it work. Candy is a really nice map color. Yeah, the light blue. The AI is cheating. No, I wouldn't say they're cheating. I would say that they're targeting us, but... Karma Decay sounds good. More dev costs. Stab hit to declare war. What the heck? I'll pass on that. Okay, this is fine, I think. Having, like, four boats might be what saves you in the War of Independence. That's what I'm saying. Often ally Kote because they want VJ to take Lanka. Sri Lanka? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I get it. I'm just saying. They could literally ally anybody over here. Any of these little dudes. It's all good. I'm not that I'm not upset. So now we just need to wait. So Oh, my loans are so small. Okay. Let's turn my army off for one. We have no forts. So we just need to chill and, you know, collect some money. I really do think that just getting one heavy will be good for that. All we need to do is blockade this, full occupy him, and we're good. And if we can rush Miltech, we're getting nine points a month. Okay. We might be able to do that. Actually blockade it. Right, used to have a path. I'm used to this. AI laughs and no attrition. Two loan for one regiment. Yeah, don't you like that? As long as he only keeps three units, that's actually totally doable. Because we'll just build like one more over the limit. I can just declare independence with no allies. So this should, this should be pretty straightforward. Alright, let's just speed five for a moment. So we can get this heavy ship building. It's going to kill our economy. Yo, Soul Grid. Thank you so much. Five gifted subs, you legend. Rosa, Planet, Cactus, Silver, and uh, Thor's Drake. Make sure you guys say thank you to Soul Grid. I appreciate you, Casey. Thank you so much, man. Always so generous. Kote declared war on Venad, huh? I'm still going to keep my army turned down. I'm not going to help them. And uh, let's get our Carrick building. Not enough sailors. Damn. Okay, I guess Barks it is then. Now, the dream is that a couple of his ships get sunk. Oh, whoa, yo, Barking Glad, another five gifted subs. I heard the not name, I heard the, the sound. I'm like, wait, is this still going? Thank you so much, dude. 10 gifted subs within a couple of minutes of the stream starting. You guys are very generous. Thank you so much. And thank you all for the follows as well. I, we're gonna hit 4,500 follows today, which is really cool. So I'm glad to have you guys all here. Thank you so much. If you guys got gifted sub, make sure you say thank you. 
Don't want to have to do this. And Gunsmith, thank you. Three whole months, man. Wonderful, man. Glad to have you here. 1992, best year to be born was 93, in my opinion. But, you know, that's up for debate. Hype train. Got a scam train. Level four, apparently? Is that a thing? Have to defend your number one icon? <laughs> Hey man, if it's what if it makes you feel better, you can do that. I certainly will not complain. I'm thankful for you guys. The Pora Box, thank you for your Prime sub as well, man. You're a legend. Level five is max. Oh yes, I'm aware. Hype hype. Thank you, boys, so much for supporting the channel. I appreciate you. He just went in there with no general. You wanna support my independence? Nope. I am uh, definitely hostile to you. So his army is over there. Hmm. That's a bummer, man. Sub goal 101. <laughs> Raining subs. I appreciate you, boys. 96. That's for babies. 98 is for infants. What did I miss? Just got home? Well, welcome, M4. You didn't miss much. I meant to say really love supporting that thick, juicy ass. Nothing to, nothing to do with being number one. Well, I appreciate you regardless. Whether you support me for my booty, for the for the, the sins of the flesh. Hope to see you actually struggle during this one. Met your channel during the Germany gameplay. Oh, believe me, if you want to see me struggle, come to stream. You'll see me struggle, my friend. So that's his five transport ships. Oof. I'm not so sure about this. His army is trapped over there, man. This would be my opportunity here, but I assume this war is going to be over before. I would really, really... Best case scenario is, is he takes this siege and these this fleet goes out and does some damage to his ships. Ooh. That's a tragedy. Did he lose any? Oh, he pieced out anyways. Okay, well, let's see how we can manage this. Let's have you guys protect trade and carry Mandel for a bit. I'll go one more over the limit if it means we have a chance to blockade our overlord. So, yeah. Hmm. Get an admiral? Well, of course, yeah. What's up, Klaus? How are you, buddy? Flashback to Poland. Yeah, that, that campaign was absolute cancer. I got a stretch here from Verisi. So, let's do that. Everybody stretch along with us. Also, I moved the camera. I felt like... This is a more flattering angle. It was like way at my side. So all the time you were like looking at me like this, I felt like it looked weird. So I'm my weak chin showing, you know. Kote take a province? Yeah, he did. Took one province over here. <laughs> What's up, such brain? Gonna sub to the OnlyFans instead. AQJ. You're in for a treat. So now he's got two units. Man, I am so tempted to do this. Let's send a scornful insult so he doesn't, like, must have positive prestige. Right. Well, we'll do that eventually. Nice. Yeah, that's fine with me. And I need two base tacks over here, so let's actually do that. It's going to help our economy out anyway, so I'm fine with that. Gives us prestige. We can scornfully insult you. May your sky be filled with comets. That will save us a stab whenever we declare war. Balmanis will join. So we have five ships to his six. He's got four transports. Hmm. His his admiral is only a one zero two though. He smells like butts. I'll tell him you suck, and I hate you. Hmm. <laughs> Joined a little late. What's the situation? Uh, we're a vassal and we're just kind of chilling because we're having a hard time getting anything going here. Where are we steering from? Here and then here. Okay. Is VJ up here? I assume they are. Yeah, cool. So let's get some more spy network on VM. Damn, dude. Are you kidding me? That's dumb. Just chilling. Our ruler died the first week. Yeah, it's true. But this ruler's better. Now we just have to deal with low legitimacy and negative prestige. <laughs> it's all good, man. It's all part of the plan. Trust the process, right? 
Thank you, boys, for the hype train. I appreciate you guys so much. Your support is wonderful. I don't deserve you. I don't deserve you. But I'm thankful for you anyways. Vinny looking real juicy. Yeah, getting that claim. But uh, I definitely assume that he's got... Um, <laughs> he's got the Navy to fight us down, so... I think we need one more ship. Let's go with, like, a single galley. Once we have the sailors. Oh, we actually can't afford it. Yikes. Alright, let's pull our navy in so we can afford a galley. Take tech. There we go. Let's buy one galley. It's not inland seas. But they have more cannons, so it should be good. What kind of dev is Sri Lanka? Not much. Hey, Nick. Welcome back, buddy. Two whole months with your prime sub, you legend. Seven, Ooh. seven. Woo. <laughs> Thank you all for the follows. We're only seven away from 4,500. Legends. Okay. So as soon as we get this galley, I am going to attack. Candy get unique missions? Nah, probably not. War plunder, apparently. I think these are like generic. Yeah, these are just generic Indian ideas. That's the politics they meant. Saw the video. Cheers, man. What do follows do? Um, in it directs people to my channel. Lets people know that I'm live. You know, might have low dev now, but once those institutions start appearing, you'll have to turn Sri Lanka into a metropolis. Well, I don't know about Sri Lanka. This province right here is good. Aside from that, like some stuff down here on the coast, like these are farmlands, so we'll definitely want that. Why so low legitimacy? Because my my king died literally like five minutes in. Let's recall you, get some spy network on you. As soon as the ship is done, we're going to attack him. Let's make sure we get a decent admiral. All right, I'll take him. It's better than the alternative. Let's make you a guy. Oh, he's building up. <laughs> All right. Let's try this now. I don't need stab anyways. Stab is overrated. And I'm somehow losing this fight for reasons. So let's come on over here. Should be a wipe. Very good. Apparently, he's able to pull some more men up, pop them out of the ground. Play some whack-a-mole here for a moment. They'll be done on uh, the 10th of January, so we can totally just split these guys up for now. <clears throat> Let's boost our stab up a bit. Hurting our legitimacy quite a bit. As long as we have people covering his entire provinces where we're good. Put into the treasury. I'll take the admin points so we can buy stab up. And our legitimacy, or we'll be able to buy down our war exhaustion, so it's no big deal. Yep, we have naval supremacy. So I think we're good. They should not be able to walk across this strait. I'm almost positive. I will be very, very surprised if they can walk across that. And let's also get a general. So I don't have my um, my dude leading the siege. Bamanis ally would be a 1444. I, I don't know. I figured we're okay because we could just blockade him. And then we'll full annex him here. We'll even take this province over here probably. You know? Should be fine, right? So let's leave behind... The transports to blockade, and these guys can come over here and uh, blockade our, his capital. That should be it. Told you if you were blockading, I know. I'm having a really hard time, like, clearing my throat right now. It's very irritating. All right, he's got a province over there I forgot about. Getting access through VJ is cursed anyways. True, he doesn't even have access. Well, that's kind of funny. Booster stab up. And then one more. I'll probably... I probably will dev Renaissance. Looks like it hasn't spawned yet. Once we win that, we should be able to... Just kind of sit on it and wait. Who's this? Dev Renaissance and candy? Yeah. I'm thinking this Kote province might be better because it's grasslands. 35% dev cost for fi for a forest or jungle. 
Big Tens to declare on all those South Miners. Can I have to wait for Bomanis to leave? Oh, yeah. I won't be able to do the whole five-year thing because I'm not going to be able to occupy this province. Right, I don't have sailors. Um, this is risky. This is really risky, actually. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay. We're winning, we're winning, we're winning. Okay, we, we sunk a ship. <laughs> cool. So let's let give these guys a couple of repair ticks. If we see them crossing the strait... Oh, actually, I don't think I can see them, can I? So I'm going to sit out here, and then I'll just dock up before the monthly tick to make sure we get it. I'll have to... Yeah, they don't have access, so this is fine, actually. He'll, he'll go bankrupt, leading that army there. One without an admiral. I have an admiral. Check access? Yeah, I am. We're good. He doesn't have access. But I'll blockade him over here. I don't want any rebels to spawn. It's going to be very irritating. Let's take a look at the military. Or the... Uh, no, not military. Uh, score. So he's got two loans already. What's up, Ringo? Candy rules the waves. We have no sailors. I think I actually just need to, like... Ooh, nice. Yeah, totally. I'll do that. Need some legitimacy, finally. Stock up the guys. So we're not spending sailors. It's a little min-maxy. Well, we definitely need to do it. I cannot comprehend how irritating this is that I can't clear my throat. You're not Ringo? <clears throat> You're not Emperor Ringo? Or Emperor Ingo. Ah, I got gotcha. you. You send them to repair? Where the cotton provinces are? Yeah, they're mostly in the north up here, I think. Uh, where are we at here? Cotton, right here. Yep. Okay, now they're down here. All we need to do is get a couple of them and dev them up. We're good. My bad, Ingo. Karma? Yeah, I'll take Karma. A lot of cotton. Oh, yes. What's up, Jaren? How you doing, buddy? Welcome to everybody that's here. If you guys have not already, make sure you follow. We're streaming multiple days every week. Lots of fun stuff to be had here. Any tags that Candy can form? So, let me make sure. As caught, as Candy. So, I have to be Candy for this one. But, the, um, I think the Buddha strikes back. We don't have to be Candy. Owned by Candy. Uh, if anybody can, as Kote or Candy, hmm. We might not be allowed to, uh, call to, uh, form a nation. It would be nice to form, like, a Barat or something, but... Favorite game except EU4? Mm, I play a lot of League, sadly. Hey, just wanted to just... I always wanted to see me do this one. Well, cheers, man. Let's do it. Ah, crap. Losing more sailors. So I have to wait for Bamanis to peace out. This is going to be annoying. Guy told me to tell him after the leaderboard. How are we planning to expand into mainland India? Slowly and carefully. We'll probably ally Bamanis and use him to beat up on VJ, honestly. That's that's the most realistic route. You have to be Kotair Candy. That's kind of dumb. Yeah, we're just going to sit on it. He's on high enthusiasm for reasons. I'm doing this so we don't spend sailors, so we, we can actually reinforce, by the way, if anybody was wondering. Plan on doing a Lotharingia campaign on YouTube? I already did, man. Go check it out. Check out my playlists. A lot of people ask me if I'm going to do X 
you know, campaign. Just check my playlist. I, I guarantee you, you'll probably find something you want. I have played a lot of YouTube EU4. Later on, if you conquer uh, extra missionary, which is nice. Oh, really? Right, so let's take a look at... Our karma is... It was negative, but we got it up. And so because of that, we get five discipline and a diplo rep. Pretty good. Karma is an irritating mechanic, honestly. Why did I bother playing as candy? Why did you bother not reading the title or checking the plan? It's an achievement run, homie. What's up, a radiated sea bear? How are you? I like your name. Just saw the Vinny Vidi Vici Savoy will be your next campaign. Cheers, man. Yeah, that was a fun campaign as well. Uh, you'll see some shenanigans early on. Belmontis will want out here in like a year and a half, which is fine with me. Yep, most people know about Venice. Cheating ass Venice. We're making a lot of money right now, actually. Savoy Piedmont. It's uh, Sardinia Piedmont. Fun until the Venice War. Hey, no spoilers. But yeah, most people know about Venice. Just got the cotton candy achievement pun. Yeah, man. Hey, look, Leap Year. Oh, wait, no, not Leap Year. Is Leap Year in the game? I'm actually not familiar. If you declare war and no fighting sieging happens for five years, you get a white piece forced on you. Uh, I did not know that, no. No Leap Year? Having a very slow mental day? I hear that. No Leap Year in the game at all? Busted. Unplayable. Worth to play Delhi these days? Yeah, Delhi's a cool cool nation to play as. Hmm. Already have the land of Eastern Jade, otherwise that's another achieve you can do this run. Uh, I'm not familiar with that one. Is it up here? Um, doesn't look like it. Is it the land of Eastern Jade? Yeah, I don't see it. Turn the table. I think we can do that. Oh, I can't vassalize them. I have to do it in a separate war, it looks like. So this is the piece that I want. Something like that. It's in the list. Sombrero icon. Land of Eastern Jade. Own a core province in Central America as a Buddhist country. Cool, yeah, we can do that. What's up, Nico? How you doing? I have a feeling this is going to be a decently long campaign. I also missed a stretch from uh, Sivostik. So let's get a stretch in chat. Uh, uh, stretch. Spinal mobility. Important. Actually, in Mexico, not Central America. Mexico is Central America. Just so you know. Mexico is like... In the middle there. North, North Central America. Good. I'm doing wonderful, Nico. Candy Colonial Empire. Gotta stretch so hard the whole house hears you. Gonna do like a... I What's the benefit of Nepal tag switch? We can't switch tags, sadly. El Mexico is North America. Norte America. This is for an achievement. Exclamation point plan. How's your debt looking, dude? Four loans? <laughs> and I'm gaining money. Feels good, man. I guess we can just speed five for now. Honestly, I can turn my army off as well. No reason not to. He's got unrest, so he's probably gonna get rebels. Yep, yeah, he got rebels. Hopefully they don't win it. I 
The early prestige is nice. Did I get all the loot? I don't know. Do I really care about all the loot? There you go. Oof, indeed. They're on low. Sadly, I don't know what to do with these rebels. More prestige sounds good. Try the Anbanar mod? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We tried it on stream a couple of weeks ago. I was playing as the, um, the whatchamacallit, hydration? Yes, sir. Everybody drink up. It's important. I was playing as the orcs <clears throat> and I tried a, um, demonsterization and it was like super irritating. So I kind of rage quit, honestly. I want to bump the army spending. Don't trust those rebels. Another hydration. Mike likes Hollister. All right. Trick up. And another one? Alright, cool. <clears throat> I'm not gonna be able to peace out, probably. Unless I peace out Bumanus. Yeah, look. He won't even accept the white piece. Fierce negotiator. Holds Bidar. What? Oh, 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 oh. My bad. I misclicked. But I want, like, all of this. Like, I'm not going to peace out without let, taking that. So, probably not. I'll just build up over my force element and kill them. We have... Yeah, we're fine. I will turn my army maintenance up, though. Actually, let's see here. My force element's actually probably higher, yeah. So, let's actually get a cav in there as well. And I'll come over here and I'll uh, start sieging this back. We're good. We're not even losing money. Won't the rebels TP to the last province and kill him? Uh, possibly. I'm not sure. I'm blockading the straight, so I'm not sure exactly how that works. We just need to peace out Bamanes, so we just need to wait a month or two, and we're good. There we go. Just Oh, he's a fierce negotiator. Ooh, that might not actually work then. Another stretch and another hydration? What the heck? You guys are wild. I'm trying to trying to sabotage me, make me pee my pants. I'm definitely going to have to take a pee break. Generally, I try not to, but um, we're definitely going to need it. So I owe M4 and Shay generalships. So we'll definitely be doing that. You guys are taking a little bit of attrition. Do it! Do it. Just, Just do it. do it! <laughs> Thanks, Nick. Drink your water. When nature calls, one must go. It's very important. Another hydration. <laughs> You guys are ruthless. <clears throat> Here, check out what I can do. Go ahead, give me another hydration chat. Do it, just scared you. That's kind of the point of it, honestly. Empower the Poligars, dev cost, infantry combat ability. That is really strong. Okay, I'll take it. National manpower and force limit contribution from vassals. That's pretty good as well. Boys won't stop till you explode. Well, I turned it off, so they can't do it anymore. So, yeah. Yo, yet another one. Thank you for the gifted sub. Alexander, make sure you say thank you. India Gaming. Dictator, give us back our water. <laughs> my chat, my rules. You poo-poo doo-doos. One of the most attractive reforms to ever reform. It is a pretty reform, I have to say. Let's get more loot. Look at all this devastation over here. These dudes are done for. Nick! Chat making some noise. Thanks for the thanks for the dono, buddy. I'll do some push-ups for that. Let's go. 
trying to get swole, chat. Nobody look at my butt. I'm self-conscious. Always making comments about my booty. Thanks for the five bucks, buddy. I appreciate you. <clears throat> Chips are dying. Lamau. Got cake. Damn, boy, he thick, boy. That's the whole point of it, man. Here you go, chat. Do you feel better now? I can come up here since he got some... I'll pick up some sailors here. Yo, this is cancer. Of course he has to be a fierce negotiator, you know? I'm curious if I go and blockade him if it'll give me enough. Ooh. Main content during lunch? Well, cheers, Alexander. I appreciate that a lot, man. Thank you. I'll take the money. We're going to end up devving Kote. Nightmare fuel. <laughs> Love how AI wants to stick in the war but has zero benefit from doing it whatsoever. Yeah, it's broken. Blockade him? Yeah, I know. I'm letting my sailors tick up. Let's see here. Let's turn our army maintenance back down. We don't need it. Save some cash. Oh. Still no mill access. Yikes. Bamanis popped out a navy with two heavy ships. Uh, yeah, that's bad, actually. That's really bad. How did that happen? He had no ships at the beginning of this war, man. Ooh. Nani? Nani? <laughs> Let's do some push-ups for that one. Oi. One, two, three, four, five, eight. Eight sounds good, right? That was... Nani? That was me when I realized that Bamanis has two freaking heavy ships. Oh, yeah, here they are. Still no mill access, though. He has no admiral. I'm losing ships. Yo, you've got to be kidding me, man. This game is a joke. This game is an absolute joke. Ooh. Hmm. Yeah, it's pretty bogus, honestly, but whatever. Yeah, Bamanis is not going to peace out. I wonder if he rolled that or if that's in, like, 1444. Oh, I have to say something nice to Bernston? Oh, Bernston. You're a, you're a wonderful boy. A great lad, if you will. And I appreciate you. I'm always glad to have you here in chat. Whatever. Independence. I'm going to turn around and immediately but, uh, rip them. Go ahead, protect trade, Caramendel. Get some claims. What? I can't get a claim on there? Cancer. All right, so. We're going to dev this. As soon as it's done coring. Can't get claims on Matarai. Yeah, it's annoying. Whatever. It is what it is. Our economy's strong. Feels good, man. Human sacrifices. What the heck? The human sacrifice? I'll take the karma. Local dev cost. Not in the right province, though. But I'll take the karma. Visible anger. Can't claim shit in Kote. Uh, yeah, sure. I'll lose a base tax in my capital. Why not? All of that for one province. Gonna end up having rebels anyways. Not ideal. 
religious stats. So we get advisor cost and tolerance of heretics, which is fine. But uh, karma gives us five discipline and diplo rep, two diplo rep. Try invading Africa, reverse colonialism. Goodness gracious, you guys are horrible. I just need to core this up so I can dev it. I will definitely take the prestige and a half off admin guy is great. Yeah, half a ducat a month for that. Not bad. All right, let's dev it. It's going to help out with the... It'll get rid of all this. So since we want to spend the most on mill, since we have the most points for it. And there you go. So far, so good. We're definitely going to go into the hole for this. But I'm also not going to really... Tr I'm going to try to not fall behind on mill. Sure, dude. Upgrade the center of trade for the discount? Nah. Well, okay, I guess for the one. Yeah, the one time. Oh, yeah, you have to upgrade it to a 1,000 to get the tech discount. But I will upgrade it for the money, for the trade. That'll actually be worth. Let's, um... Ooh, land maintenance is nice. We can afford it, too, so we should. We should probably find some allies, huh? Matter I? Maldives, Corchin, Prome. Shout out DDR Jake. Bamanis, I think this is what you want, dude. I'm threatened by him. Level two gives 5%. Did it say that? Oh, it does. You're right. Well, that's yeah, okay. We're good. Can imagine the second he makes an ally against War Deck by Ming or VJ. The ally will. I'm gonna not take admin so I can take their tech and keep them at least somewhat even. I also don't really want to take mill tech, honestly. So, or want to take mill tech. Sure, sounds good, man. So we have construction costs, but no dev costs, really. Number of allies, at least two. Yeah, we can do that. So yoink some crown land. And then... Yeah, oh, he's allied to VJ, so that's actually good for us. Trust is negative because of the war deck. Free admin mana. Yes, please. How am I doing today? I'm good. I'm doing wonderful, Polyantis. How are you? How scuffed Europe will be this run? Oh, yeah. When you play outside of Europe, it's always crazy. So threatened by X Nation that I am to completely conquer it in two to three wars. That's my plan. I'm not going to Royal marry him. I don't care. Take the prestige. Okay. Um, falling behind on Diplo is fine. Admin is okay. Not mill though. So no more mill dev if I can avoid it. Remember, this is helping our economy out quite a bit as well. So you guys are friendly to me, yeah? If they flip to friendly, we could probably get them as an ally. Are we at force limit? We can get one more. Let's pick up an ally over here. These guys will befriend me. Ukrainian Ireland. Hey, 4,500. Lads. Life's good, huh? I'll take siege ability. It's fine. Notice if you play a fast pace in Europe, all other countries play a fast pace too. Same for slow pace. Uh, you mean as far as like if you do a lot of conquering, the AI does a lot of conquering as well? How does one play past 1520? Maybe I blob too much. Are you talking about like getting coalitioned or something? Uh, I don't know. I guess I never really thought too much into it, Alexander. Okay, we're pretty close to getting this. Oh, it's so expensive. This will be good though. Ideally, I do the last two dev clicks or Diplo. 
So we let our admin and milk catch up. That way we can take tech on a, and it'll be a good price. Nice. The natty separatist for uh, these guys. All right, cool. Let's pick up these guys as an ally. I don't really want to keep them as an ally. I just wanted to get this. So I'm going to immediately dissolve it. <laughs> kind of funny, but. I can't rival anybody else, even though we did a bunch of dev. Welcome all the new followers. Glad to have you guys here. Surfing Burnification. That's a good name. Can't pass a mission in Austria because Gotland broke free from Denmark and it's reformed and I can't declare on him. How come you can't declare on him? Take the land maintenance. That's fine. Take the trade efficiency. He should pay for himself. That's good. Karma for ducats. And dev in our capital. Let's do that. I'll do one mill click. And then the last one will be production. At least I think that will be enough. We'll see. Yes. Huzzah. Only thing is I don't have any allies to sell it to, which is a, which is really sad. Especially for any MP sessions. VJ Rivals. Bamanis, Orisa. Okay. Uh, we can pick up Orisa. Our force limit's probably gone up, which is good. Build up to it. Why not? 33 bucks to embrace. That is cheap. Half off natural scientist and 15 prestige. I will take it. Yeah, we'll be able to get Arissa. What about you guys? Oh yeah, we can we can actually get Bamanis as well. Oh, let's uh let's actually just take Bamanis. There we go. Because if they're rival to each other, I'd rabble, rather have Bamanis for sure. Ooh, he doesn't want it. Really? Okay, well I guess I'll take Arissa. Hmm. Point at which if you play your early game good, late game is just declare war, conquer claims, wait for truce. Yeah, definitely. But Monus was allied to Kote before. Yeah, they were allied to them when I declared independence. Doesn't matter. Um, what's his navy looking like? He's got 10 ships. Man, that is so annoying. Will I be posting your point of view of the Holy War MP? Nah, probably not. I uh, I recorded only like half of it and then I was like, this is stressful. MP is just not my thing, man. Flagship, well, it costs 200, it costs 300 sailors to do a flagship. So it's out of the question, sadly. Oh, what am I doing? Wasted like 90 minutes. Yeah, that's a that's unfortunate. Ooh. Yeah, forgot to embrace institution first. So, unfortunate. No, I wasted mana. Saves coming for 90 mil. Worth. Is this a restart? Hell no. No, I uh, I wasted mill mana, which is unforgivable. <laughs> 1444. Unstable game. Never got saves coming. What is there to get? <laughs> Fourteen forty-four for ninety mil. Yeet. Hey, there you go, radiant sea bear. How do you do it? Oh, Alt F four. You just hit Alt F four and it uh, crashes whatever whatever you're running at the time. Single player, calm down with the saves coming. <laughs> Can't forgive yourself. Yeah, a year and a half to two years worth of mana. It's good. Just an accident, mild Alt F4. Yeah, if you have an accident, you're just like, ah, damn it. I misclicked something, Alt F4, restart. It's... It's cheap because it allows you to get away with making mistakes. Hmm. I don't think I can do this. 
Because I'm pretty sure he's got heavy ships still. He's got nine. Yeah, I don't think we can do this, honestly, man. We did ally Arissa, yeah. Man, I'm not really sure what to do here. Because I can't even get a claim on the Maldives or any Maldives. I, I can't expand at all. I'm trying to let... Uh, yeah, we're definitely just going to embrace this. There's no reason not to. Arcoboussier. AI, the player aren't playing the same rules. Alt F4 is legit. Playing around no mill access for Bamanis. Yeah, the issue is... Uh, well, it's true he probably wouldn't be able to get mill access, but he probably could, or his vassal could. Like, that's the thing you always got to remember. If I declare, and then his vassal, who, you know, probably has a fine relationship with... Let's take a look here. I'll show you what I'm talking about. Vassals always screw up mill access, so never, 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 never count out um, this. Um... Okay. This is pissing me off. Thank you. So, Korchin... Um, what in the world? There we go. Vigiar Vigianagar has a, a friendly, a protective 94%. So he'll probably give him access, which would give Balmanis conditional access. Which means Balmanis would come through bring his two heavies down, beat up on my navy, and then march across and siege me down. Still needs to transfer troops in his ships? Uh, no, he wouldn't need to. He'd be able to march them through because he has naval supremacy over me. So I think we do just have to speed five for a little bit. 1444? Nah. Nah, we're cool. Yo, are you kidding me? He was, he was young too, wasn't he? Shit. Okay. Kote. Oh, it's grasslands too, man. All right. Let's just come up here and let them siege that. Oh, man. That's annoying. Okay. Hmm. So here's how we do this. You like that? Yes. Fight for me. Fight for me and I'll take the winner. I'll take the winner. <laughs> oh, it worked too. How awesome is that? Big brain chat. Big brain. Let's go. Holy crap. I actually didn't know if it was going to work. <laughs> Yo, somebody clip that, please. That was awesome. That was so cheesy. God bless. That was awesome. <laughs> Alright, let's boost our stab up, too. Separatist rebels? They were. So they were separatist rebels as well as event-spawned pretender rebels. So what I did was, since they were above 50% and they were a large number, I can provoke them. They popped up, and then the Pretender Rebels spawned in from the event. Pretender Rebels are going to win because Pretender Rebels are stronger. And I go in and I finish up. I mop the floor with the Rebel Pretender Rebels that are already completely destroyed. Yeah, Missionary Strength. We're going to need it. We already have 5.5%. Not bad. Oh, come on now. The former Overlord. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They're going to end up breaking free over here, which is cool. To Venad. They've been there for a while, too. Be gone, Hindu. I want the good, I want the trade power. It's going to help our economy out. Decrease autonomy. Yeah, we're going to end up having Rebels sooner or later, but that's actually going to be really good for our economy because this is 35 dev. Look at the dev down here. 
This is one province has the most dev in the entirety of India. Not bad, huh? And then you look at our tech and we're like... Uh, Bamanus is 466. Yeah, 456. We're like right with him. Sell institution. If uh, if he'll buy it, that's the problem. Is a lot of the time they can't. Outside colonial range. Yeah, I can't. Oh, I can sell it to him for 0.2 ducats a month. Sounds good, man. What's up, smelly chicken? One autonomy click? Nice. Yeah, it's not bad. It's definitely not bad. So, the issue is definitely naval supremacy. I have the sailors now that I need to get at least one heavy. Money, money. The flag of the nation between VJ and Kote. Exclamation mark. Right here. It's like a hand holding a torch. We broke. Can we afford a heavy? Eventually. I uh, need to turn my army maintenance down. Let's mothball that stack there. Can't even afford the planks. Now nah, we will be able to. We're chilling. We're chilling. That's it. That's all we got to do. Chill. Bengal, man. All these dudes are rival to each other. This is tough. The fact that Bamanis won't be friendly to me is actually a big deal because it means that I can't use him to beat up on VJ. Orissa is like one third the strength of him. Like, I'm as strong as Orissa. Nice. That's actually really good if I can rival him. I'll take Diplo, please. Quantity economic? Of course. Probably. I mean, let's be real. What do you think we're going to take? I'll take the prestige. We need it. And my legitimacy is super low again because we had a low, a weak claim error apparently. Not religious. We'll take religious eventually. Exploration. I mean, I'd rather get into India, but we, we might be able to do some exploration stuff. We could actually raise the black flag if we wanted to, I think. Do we want to be a pirate? We could totally be a pirate. <laughs> Strong as Arissa is like four times your provinces, Count Chewy. Uh, yeah, and he has two more military regiments and less manpower. Sir. <laughs> Tell me how you know more about the game than me. Hmm? Time to conquer all of India. Eventually. We will eventually. Hmm. How can you form a pirate republic? Uh, so the way that you do it, the way that you do it is you, um, all you have to do is have positive two stability and then be on an island, which we are, have less than six or less provinces, which we do. And then uh, privateer at least 10% in your capital node, which is Karamandel, which would probably be tough, but we could probably manage that. And then be up like at least 50% or 75% of your force or something like that. What DLC? All of them. Country is tall. Yeah, we're real tall. Spice lines and come back later on. But all provinces need to be coastal. Um, um I think maybe they do, but I'm not sure. Forming Barat later. Uh, we're not allowed to for the achievements. We have to be Kote or Candy for all of them, but... Yeah, if we wanted to, we could just move our capital. It only costs us 100 or 200 admin. It's not a big deal. Just need to be on an island? Are you? Uh, I'm not sure, Royker. I think they might actually need to all be co coastal. But uh, I'm not entirely sure about that one. So this will be really good because we'll be able to take our um, quantity ideas first. Please. Ugh. Okay. He's not not terrible. Not not too terrible. Let's go with uh, Barking Glad. Two five five's all right. Yeah, not bad. I don't hate it. Looking at hundreds, if not thousands, of hours of gameplay. 